Hey y'all, I'm here at Seattle Center again. Uh, I walk through here a lot because I get inspired here. Um, it is where there are a lot of music arts facilities and goings on. But today I want to just talk about the fact that music, the arts, any form of the arts, they are a profession. <laughs> Let me say that again. Music, the arts, is a profession and should be worked as such. For me, part of what my workshops are about, they are about um, educating people, the general public, that when you work at something, when you get a degree in something, when you go out and you're making a living at it, that's a profession. It's not a pastime, it's not a hobby. And it's kind of insulting when people approach you as if it's a hobby and not a profession. And I don't think people realize that. So, um, I'm a professional singer. I'm a composer and arranger. I've done studio work, stage work. I work behind the scenes. This is my profession. And part of the reason why I came up with the Artist Life Coaching Workshops is I also think that we artists discount ourselves too much. We have to say, I'm a professional at this. And if I choose to do something which is not paying me, there's got to be a reason for it. A bigger reason than, you know, learning more. I've learned a lot by this time. There are some people that are just coming out that need to um, pay their dues, just like I paid my dues. But Please do not suggest to professional musicians to go sit in. That's not a valid suggestion. That's like telling a manager in a hotel that you should go to another hotel and work for free. And I know people don't think about it that way. And so part of what this video is about is educating people. Educating people to the fact that when you choose to be a professional artist, in whatever genre you choose, whether it's singing, dancing, painting, sculpting, etc., 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 then you're choosing to be a professional at it and choosing to work as a professional at it. Now, I know those are wide-ranging thoughts and, and concepts, but part of what my workshop series is about is honing in on helping people to fine-tune, to focus on what they need to do as an artist to become a working paid artist or continue being a working paid artist. Because if we're doing artistry as full time, we expect to be paid. <laughs> we have bills too. And we wanna live a life. We wanna enjoy our life. I know that being an artist is hard and that's what everybody says, but it isn't impossible. It's just that artists aren't taught other options, other things that they can possibly do at their craft to make a living. And so again, that's what my Artist Life Coaching workshops are about. And if you're interested, holler at me. Um, you can look on my website, which is semiproductions.com, which is S-Y-M-I productions.com. And why is it semi? That's another story which may, maybe I'll tell you about uh, in another video. Also, if you want to know some of my background, you can look on my Cherie Seymour Singer Facebook site and see what I've done. Um, I've tried to put my resume on there, but also tell stories and pictures about the work that I've done. And again, artists, we need to respect ourselves too. And when we do, other people will as well. Peace.